Hey everyone, welcome back to Crit Row. In this video, I'm going to be going over the Building System Supreme by Silver Spur Studios. This was gifted to me for free. Let's go ahead and check this out. So first of all, it is 100% multiplayer replicated. They have foliage, land tools, visual themes, resource pickup systems, animated NPCs, and a lot of buildables. So as you can see in these, there's just so much information on each of these images. It's actually kind of hard to look at. Let's go ahead and open this in Unreal Engine and check this out. All right, so I've gone ahead and opened the project. Let's go ahead and check this out. So it says key B to enter build building mode uh, over here. It says dense foliage area control wheel to increase cultivator speed. And then over here, start building the foundation, new location for your new home. So overall pretty cool starting point, a uh, demo project, I mean, and they also have a little demonstration over here at the uh, beginning of the level. Let's go ahead and check this out. So pretty awesome. We have this nice UI that kind of flows in. I'm going to go ahead and click B to enter building mode. Uh, middle mouse button to click land tools and then right click to open the library. So let's go ahead and let's start with land tools. Okay. Wow. This is actually pretty sick. <laughs> Holy crap. So I can, uh, use my mouse wheel to scroll down on the bottom left. There is a Heather buttercup, Yarrow, uh, boy Myrtle and so on. I see a bunch of different things and I see Boulder pretty cool. Let's go ahead and just, uh, let's do Boulder. Okay, so I have to select field grass because I'm in the field grass. So this is pretty cool. So I'm cutting the grass. I'm destroying the foliage. Oh, wow, that's sick. <laughs> this feels like a really complicated system to just uh, create from scratch, but I'm glad these guys kind of did it for us here. Let's go ahead and clear this up. And the middle one says change plant. Okay, so I can I can position like grass again, as well as uh, these yarrows. I guess this is what the flower is called. Uh, buttercups. Okay. Wow. I can kind of go crazy here and I've just gone ahead and added a ton and let's actually go back and just kind of destroy everything that we did. So let me actually go there and try cultivating the boulder. So I have boulder selected and I can use control mouse wheel to increase or decrease the speed. So you can kind of see that, uh, rotating over there where it says control speed. So let's try max speed. Okay. Let's try the lowest speed. Okay, I see. So it's taking a little bit while it hovers over in order to actually cultivate it. So that's pretty cool. I can also use shift mouse wheel to increase the size. Oh, that would have made things so much easier if I just started with that. That's crazy. Let's let's go ahead and start cutting this field grass. So this is kind of cheating, but I'm gonna just do it. I'm gonna just keep going in and out like this. I can get grass all the way from there from where I'm at. Oh, let me actually increase the speed so it's instant. Yeah, wow, this is really quick. Okay, that's crazy. Sorry if you get motion sickness, but I got to do this. I got to make my home. Um, okay. The other thing is I wish there were icons with all of them, but I get it. Like you can easily add that on your own, uh, kind of like this big leaf flower has just so I know what these are. Cause I don't know what like bog myrtle is or yarrow buttercups and all that. But I guess if I just do everything, it's cool. Oh, there's a remove all. Oh my God. I'm so dumb. I literally ignored that. And that was the first thing it showed me. Okay, that's awesome. <laughs> I'm really glad. I'm really glad I could just delete everything. All right, now I'm going to right click, save and back. And now I'm going to open the library and I can start building. This is kind of like what you guys are waiting for, but I think I spent like a good 20 minutes just cleaning grass. I'm, I'm lawn mowing. This is why simulator games are so popular. All right, so I can use mouse wheel to select different components. And then I can also, uh, so middle mouse button will let me switch between the, uh, I guess the genres or... Yeah, my libraries. So, all right, let's start building a little house here. So I want to use the snap key. Oh, that is so cool. It auto snaps an explosion when I build, I guess, cause I'm bringing on the heat. Let's go. This is so cool. This is replicated too, by the way, this is awesome. Uh, let's see, how do I want my dream house? This is freaking awesome. All right, let's make some walls. Uh, I want to snap it though. Backspace is to snap, I think. Okay, nice, nice. Yeah, so I click backspace and it automatically snapped. So I have uh, this nice looking pattern here. Oh shoot, I forgot, I need windows. What am I doing? How do I destroy this? Okay, I won't destroy it, I'm just gonna add. Let's add a doorway here. Uh, man, that's gonna be kind of ugly. Let's add a doorway here. And then let's just add a, uh... okay, I can use the brackets to make these bigger and smaller. So that's pretty cool. How big can I go? It doesn't end. Oh, there we go. Oh my God. I could have just used this and then I can use caps to slope it and then also change it with shift control and alt. 
man, there's so many buttons on this. It's actually, it's a whole learning session. Uh, you know what? This house is going to take forever. So let me just rotate this. All right. Just going to give myself some really nice high end fancy looking spiral steps for all you Fortnite lovers out there. Let's go. This is the never ending staircase. Wow. This is so fast. Oh shoot. No. Oh, whatever. Hmm. Run all the way up. Yeah. No, screw that. We're going up. All right. This looks like a pretty good view. I think I'm pretty much done with my dream house. Like this looks amazing. Oh wait, I need a door. Why can't I? Not a material. Uh, we don't need material. So there were a lot of other things that I needed to make, but let's go ahead and try it out. Let me just restart. All right, so I've gone ahead and restart. Oh, it saves, damn it. All right, well, it's a good plugin because it saves, but I want to restart, <laughs> to restart the whole thing. No, don't let me save it. All right, whatever, I'll just have to go over it on this so you can make crafting tables to help uh create new items like your pickaxe and harvesting tools and all that and then there's also this wheelbarrow that you can attach to animals you can also create plants and then you can also add animals um what does he do now included in bss okay so that's the add-on 1.1 animated buildable go do something go i have an army now we have our own society we don't need people from the outside of behind these mountains. You know, for uh, as many actors as I have, I'm not really lagging that much. Although I shouldn't burn out my GPU considering uh, they're increasing the prices. Not enough material to create human life? That's crazy. I can make weather. I can create environment. I'm material. Why do I need material if I'm playing the role of God? All right, uh, here's my staircase. I already have a couple of those and my mountains and so on. And man, this is freaking awesome. Like. This is actually crazy. Trigger action. What does that do? I, I'm i making them disappear. I'm deleting them. Oh, it says on the top left. Run any code you like in its own BP event graph. That's actually sick. Okay. Yeah, like I think this looks perfect. This is an amazing dream house. We have one wall in case it gets windy from that direction. We have a staircase. Ah, what a nice view. I have this long tower I can't get on top of anymore. And I have this amazing spiral staircase that everyone who's watching is jealous of. Ignore that. Ignore that. I'm deleting that. I'm, I need to delete that. No, I was already on top of it. You're good. We're good. We're good. And then I also created rain. Look at, look at my, look at my guys. They're all showering together. Nothing's wrong with this. This is our society and we've defined our rules. This is an amazing plugin. Uh, 10 out of 10 would recommend. I was gifted to this for free, but I'm definitely, this looks like something you can make a good simulation game out of. It's already ready for you. It's already network uh, replicated. And yeah, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, let me know. See you next. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.